Hello, it's Mike. Been a while since I've been on. Got a package today, and it's from a good friend of mine. Wire Paladin. Yep, that's right. Wire Paladin sent me a package. Sure enough, there. My gun uh -oh. was handcrafted <laughs> to my specifications. I rarely draw it, unless I mean to use it. Have gun, will travel. Yeah, I wasn't gonna let it play that long, but anywho. Got a package from my friend Paladin. Yeah, yeah. So I guess we'll try to get into it. I didn't open it up. I looked at the stuff already, but uh, uh, anyway, that's the way it goes. Yep, sure enough there. But anyhow, let's see if I can show what he sent me there. Kind of one of them surprise packages there again. Yeah, yeah. And I see something white in here. Let's get it out. And it be a vehicle. And from the looks of it on the side there, it's uh, ice cream. So, I guess there we're going to have us an ice cream truck. Yeah. Oh, goodness. All right, we're going to set that aside. I got to change hands because uh, I wasn't getting a, getting a grip on the phone good there. And up next, we have another car here. And it be an Audi. I think it was an Audi R8 V10. Yeah, an Audi R8 V10. Got opening doors, and it's one of these pullback ones. Yeah, I forgot to mention that on this here other one here. Same thing. Yeah, it's one of those pullbacks. Anyway, he's got some ice cream in the shelves there, and oh yep, yeah, that's two vehicles. And the third vehicle is. A little military vehicle there and it has opening doors I had opened the doors already because they're hard to get open they hard to get a hold of with my big old fingers the doors door the very small doors but uh yeah they open up yeah I don't know what I don't know what kind of vehicle it is as far as name brand you know I'm talking about the name of the vehicle you know, like Jeep, Dodge, or whatever, but I don't know what this thing is. It's just kind of a small scale. I'd say this is a probably a 143, maybe. And well, that's it'd be probably more like a 150 scale, maybe. It's bigger than a Hot Wheel, and also it's a pullback, too. And but the thing is. It's smaller than these two, so I think these are 143. I didn't see any. Uh, this is a Wally, by the way. It don't say the uh, size, but I figured this is the 143, so this is smaller. So I figured this is probably a 150, maybe 155. And then this one here, this is a king spun. It don't have no, uh, well, it may be under that sticker. It might say the scale of it. Uh, but anyhow, I thought I was going to peel the sticker off. It looked like it was sticking out where I could get a hold of it, but I guess not. So anyway, up next, what he sent me. He sent me this here, Jelly Roll 05. And... He didn't leave me no note saying what it is. I feel like this might be a silver pen or uh, I don't know. Uh, I'm sure he'll tell me. Yeah, I'm sure he will tell me what the heck this thing is. I don't know that if it's just a regular pen. I hadn't pulled it open and tried it out or whatever. 
so uh, I don't know. But up next, he sent me a map, North Lakeland area map. And so that, I guess that would be Wisconsin. Get out and explore Wisconsin. Yep. All right. Trying to get, or is that a hint, hint? All right, we got Wabash County Highway map. Wabash County dot O-R-G. It says back here, Wabash County, Wisconsin. Oh, yeah. I think he's trying to get me to come to Wisconsin. I don't know. And we got the musky shop. Yeah, he told me I didn't have to show all this, but heck, what the heck. I ain't done a video in, what, two or three weeks now? Probably longer? I don't know. Wisconsin's winery. Oh, Lord, somebody's going get, to get, uh, get tipsy. Won't be me because I don't drink. Yep. And he sent me. Oh, that's not it. Uh, I, I was I was getting ahead of myself. And this is a little car, Dr. Kate's museum. She, uh, from what I gather, she invented the snowshoe. I, I think. I, I don't know. I might be wrong. But anyway. Do you think you might have Lyme's disease? I don't know. I've been bit by ticks before, but anyway, we got a Fred Shear Lumberjack Show booklet. So I guess that's sort of like they they had a part a scene like that in the that '70s show where they the father and sons teamed up to do the lumberjack thing there. And well, then we got the waters of Minicua. I guess that's how you pronounce it. Minicua, Wisconsin. Yeah. All right. And the next up, we got a lake of torches. Yep. Yeah. And we got the Wildwood Wildlife Park and Zoo. This might be uh, some of the places he went to on vacation. And he's just showing me. I don't know. Uh, and here's that Dr. Kate Museum State Historical Marker. Angel on Angel on Snow. Uh, snow shoes. Yeah, That's, I, I couldn't tell at first. Angel on Snow shoes. So maybe she didn't invent the snowshoes. She's just an angel on snowshoes. I guess that's her way of getting around during the winter time. I don't know. And you see me this sticker, Eagle River in Wisconsin. Yep. And the last but not least, he sent me a handful of wire paladin stickers there by Georgie. Yeah, it's like we got five of them. So anyway, that's uh, that's my little box from the Paladin on YouTube there. Y'all check him out. He puts out shows to watch, old TV shows, uh, some uh, music videos. You know, he fixes up. So you know, just whatever. Uh, that's Wire Paladin on YouTube. I want to thank you there. Thank you there, Wire. Appreciate it. I said Wire. <laughs> I should have said thank you there, Paladin, because that's your name. Uh, yeah. Thanks, Paladin. And Lady Paladin probably packaged this up. So thank you there. Anyhow, I want to thank all y'all for watching. Sorry, I ain't been on here very much lately. I just ain't been up to it. Anyhow, I'm going to get on out of here. I want to thank all y'all for watching. This is Mike, and I'm gone.